It's time to learn how to from MultimediaDesigner.com. I wanted to create a quick video on how to add your logo to a PowerPoint presentation. Today I'm using PowerPoint 2013. In order to add your logo to a PowerPoint presentation, I suggest that you put it into the slide master view. Now you can get there two different ways. At the top, you'll see a pull down that's view. Now if you click on view, you'll see over on the left side, you'll see something, an icon that says slide master view. Now you can click on that or you can go down to the bottom of the screen where you see these icons and you can actually hold your shift key down and click on this icon right here which is actually the normal view that everyone sees when they create a PowerPoint presentation. Uh, but if you click on it, it actually moves it to the slide master view. That's a very quick way of doing it instead of going up to the top. Now once we're in our slide master view we want to add the logo to our slide. We do that by going up to insert picture and we import the logo. Now I imported that into the first slide that you see at the top over here on the left. Okay, the whole thing's the slide master view, but this is the theme slide master. We put the logo in there and we can actually reduce the size of the logo, like so, and we put it in the bottom right hand corner. Now by doing that, that places the logo on every single page of the slide master view. So let's say I have title slides that I want to create. So I don't want my logo to appear twice, especially on a title slide. I want my title slide to have the logo front and center, and I don't want it to be in the bottom right hand corner. Under Slide Master, I can actually go to the top of the page here and it says Hide Background Graphics. So if I click on that, my background logo is hidden from the title slide. So now I can actually go to the normal view, but if I want to insert a new slide, let's say one with title and content, I can click on that and now you see my logo is in the bottom right hand corner. But if I go back to my title slide, there's no logo because in the slide master view, I got rid of that logo. This allows me to go up to insert pictures, select that logo again and insert it. So that way that logo is front and center uh, uh, on my title slide. But the next page, it's in the bottom right hand corner because that was made part of the slide master view. So now I can go back up the new slide. Let's say I want to add a slide with two types of content. I can do that and you'll see again my logo appears in the bottom right hand corner. This is how you add a logo to the slide master view.